Virgo. This will happen in the next 48 hours for February the 9th through February the 10th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for February the 9th through February the 10th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for February the 9th through February the 10th, 2024. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for February the 9th through February the 10th, 2024. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Virgo. You guys, subscribe to my new channel, Omega333 Tarot. That's Omega333 Tarot. Thank you so much, Virgo. Virgo, these are your cards, honey. So, Virgo, you have the Queen of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This queen is a very loving, kind, compassionate queen. This is a nurturing queen. This is the mothering energy. She's very intuitive and psychic, and she searches her emotions. Could be dealing with Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces, or someone with water prominent in their chart. However, you could be taking on the energy of this Queen of Cups, using your intuition concerning something, or searching your emotions concerning something. Also with the Queen of Cups, this is a mothering, nurturing energy, so you could be dealing with the parent of your child here. Clarify the Queen of Cups for Virgo. Clarify the Queen of Cups for Virgo. Clarify the Queen of Cups. For Virgo, it is clarified with the Nine of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is you being anxious, worried, stressed, replaying things over and over in your mind, losing sleep at night, worried about something. So Virgo, you're all up in your head, stressed, worried, anxious, can't eat, can't sleep, bothered by something here. So Virgo, listen, you can tell me that something is worrying you. We're going to find out. You're using your emotions and searching your intuition concerning it, okay? But it's heavy on your mind here. Ay, ay, ay. Could be worried about a water sign or a parent here. We'll see. Virgo, you have the page of pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is news or a message about a solid, stable, committed offer. Now, this can be the news about an offer for an invite out for dinner and a movie. This can be about making things more committed. This can be about a lump sum of money, a job offer, a raise, a promotion, a bonus, a high ticket item purchase, a new home, a new car, a token of love, a gift, anything of value. This is the news or message of it. So Virgo, some type of news about practicality, money, assets, resources, property, accepting a gift, giving a gift, going out on a date, or commitment. Clarify the page of pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the page of pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the page of pentacles for Virgo. It is clarified with the seven of swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, this is someone lying, cheating, stealing, being manipulative, trying to get away with something, someone being deceptive, someone strategically devising a plan of action, someone being sneaky, trying to escape, trying to get away with something. So Virgo, some type of lying, cheating, deceptive this year, sneakiness or sneaking off. I mean, are you thinking about sneaking away from some type of commitment here? Or was there some type of lying, cheating, or deceptiveness concerning practicality or coins here or something? This deception is bothering you. Hmm. Virgo, you have the Six of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is balance, equality, reciprocity, equal give and take. This is matching the efforts, energy, time, love, patience, resources, and responsibilities in a relationship. This is balance, but this can also speak to the merchant giving to two, being generous and giving to two. This is also a payout card, a gifting someone card, assisting someone card. So Virgo, you can tell me that something is off balance here. 
Something could be out balance with the giving and receiving. You may be giving something here, receiving something here. Or you're telling me that someone was giving more, somewhere else giving to two. Clarify the six of pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the six of pentacles for Virgo. Clarify the six of pentacles for Virgo. It is clarified with the king of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This king is a very charming, charismatic character. Someone who's admired by many. This is a leader, a go-getter, a take charge type of energy. Someone who sets out on many objectives and usually accomplishes them with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their chart. However, you could be taking on the energy of this King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is someone who initiates, who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or you're wanting to take action. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. It is clarified with the Tower. The tower is Aries and Scorpio's energy. This is something that you don't see coming. Something that catches you completely off guard. Something that just rocks the foundation of you guys' relationship. This is a shock and awe moment. A moment of revelation. Now, this can be a shocking shakeup or a breakup. So, Virgo, very well could be a shocking surprise. Shocking revelation. Something being revealed or a breakup. Clarify the tower. For Virgo, clarify the tower. For Virgo, clarify the tower. For Virgo, it is clarified with justice. Could be dealing with a Libra, but you may be calling for karmic justice, saying, you know what? I'm a good person. I put good out there. I'm just expecting that good to return to me. Or you're saying that someone did me so wrong and so dirty. I'm calling for karmic justice. I want them to get exactly what they deserve. Or you're dealing with something in the justice system. Could be dealing with a Libra, but you can tell me that, hey, something isn't fair, something isn't balanced, something isn't just. You can tell me that someone wants to come in and right a wrong and bring justice to a situation. Or you're dealing with something in the justice system. Clarify justice for Virgo. Clarify justice for Virgo. Clarify justice for Virgo. It is clarified with the Ten of Wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. Something is difficult. Something is heavy. Something feels like a lot of work. Something feels like the weight of the world on your shoulders. Something is a burden here for you. Now, this is a 10, so this is an ending. This is you wanting to release a burden. So, Virgo, you're telling me that you're having a difficult time. Something is burdensome, and you're just wanting to release it. So, Virgo, listen, are you telling me that something wasn't fair, balanced, or just concerning, you know, someone giving you something here? Could be dealing with something in the justice system doesn't have to be. Or are you having to pay out something here that's burdening you? You can tell me that something wasn't fair, balanced, or just, and you're breaking up because they were giving more somewhere else, giving to two, cheating here. Did they, did they accept a gift, give a gift, go out on a date with someone else? Or are you yourself burdened by the fact that you were giving more somewhere else, giving to two? And it has you up in your head here that you accepted a gift, gave a gift, went out on a date with someone else. Could be vice versa. Virgo, you have the king of cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This king is a very loving, kind, compassionate king. He's fair and balanced in his emotions, but he does not wear his emotions on his sleeve. He's in complete control of his emotions. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Virgo could be dealing with Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces, or someone with water prominent in their chart. However, you could be taking on the energy of this king of cups. Now, the King of Cups is someone with a great deal of emotions within them, but they're not outwardly expressing their emotions. They're masking their emotions or wearing a mask. Also with the King of Cups, this is a nurturing father figure, so you could be dealing with the parent of your child here. Clarify the King of Cups for Virgo. Clarify the King of Cups for Virgo. Clarify the King of Cups for Virgo. It is clarified with the Queen of Wands, 
Aries, Leo, or Sag. This queen is a very fiery, feisty, bold, and confident energy. Someone who handles their business with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their chart. However, you could be taking on the energy of this Queen of Wands. Now, the Queen of Wands is someone who's highly motivated, a self-starter, someone who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or you're wanting to take action. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the Queen of Wands for Virgo. It is clarified with the Five of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, this is tit for tat, tug of war, one up in one another, snide remarks, having the last say, speaking ill of one another behind each other's back, backstabbing one another. This is playing mind games, ego tripping, trying to win at all costs, a bunch of mind games and manipulation. So Virgo, listen, you can tell me that you guys had this tit for tat, tug of war, toe to toe going on. Could be some form of mind games and manipulation, or you're pissed and you have an ax to grind here. Virgo, I feel like you're getting ready to take some type of action and you're not going to let emotions play a role in this. I feel like you're suited for battle for something here. Either someone shortchanged you, you may have to pay out something here and you're pissed off about it, or someone was giving more, someone else giving to two cheating here. Virgo, you have the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini, but the lover says, you know, I breathe you in, you breathe me in. We are so magnetically attracted to one another. We cannot get enough of one another. Babe, I need to make a choice. Could be dealing with a Gemini, but you can tell me that you guys have this strong twin flame magnetic pull. You can tell me there's another other lover, but the lovers could also be a partnership with work or business. Clarify the lovers for Virgo. Clarify the lovers. For Virgo, clarify the lovers. For Virgo, it is clarified with the high priestess, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is she who knows. She who knows. This is the keeper of the hidden secrets, keeper of the hidden knowledge. The universe is calling for you to use your intuition. But you may know something that you're keeping to yourself. Now, the high priestess keeps silent, so it's a good chance that you guys aren't speaking to one another. So Virgo, you can tell me that you guys aren't speaking. You can tell me that you're using your intuition or you have a secret. Clarify the high priestess for Virgo. Clarify the high priestess for Virgo. Okay. You and also the 10 of pentacles. Clarify the high priestess for Virgo. Clarify the high priestess. For Virgo, clarify the high priestess. For Virgo, it is clarified with the eight of wands. Aries, Leo, or Sag. This can indicate that things are happening quickly. This can speak to travel. But this is the fast, rapid, moving energy of communicating back and forth over the airwaves, the internet, with text messages, messenger, WhatsApp, emails, phone calls. Even face-to-face -face communication. But this is also the fast, rapid, moving energy of being intimate. So Virgo, you can tell me that something is happening quickly here. This could involve travel. You guys could have gotten into a heated discussion or argument, throwing fiery dots at one another. Or someone was communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else. Now Virgo, listen, this could all be some type of partnership with work or business. Something could be happening quickly here. It could very well be an argument taking place here, Virgo. Maybe you feel like you need to leave the situation quickly here because of some type of deception here. Virgo, you could also tell me that you're using your intuition that they were communicating passionately online with someone else or being intimate with someone else, another other lover. And I hope that because you're pissed that you're not keeping something close to your chest here, some type of secret of you dealing with another other lover to spite them, Virgo. Hmm. I'm going to take a look at the situation ship for you, Virgo. You guys, subscribe to my new channel, Omega333 Tarot. That's Omega333 Tarot. Thank you. It says soulmate, similar friendship, romantic partner. Soulmate, similar friendship, romantic partner. 
Okay, that kind of partner. What else for Virgo? What else for Virgo? And it says, negotiator, bargaining and begging. Negotiator, bargaining and begging. Huh. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Virgo, this is what happened in the next 48 hours for February the 9th through February the 10th, 2024. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at herimmortalmaj, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.